classmates. It's only me and Hobbleco. Hey everyone, it's Cupcake here. It's Halloween at the LOL school and teacher It Baby has a surprise for her students. Oh boy, well guess what? I have a surprise for you two. A surprise? What is it, what is it? Do you have a Halloween costume? I do have your Halloween costumes, but it's another surprise. Oh, please, 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 can you tell us? Yeah, I can't wait. Well, since it's all Hallow's Eve and I love Halloween so much, I will tell you what now. You're getting new classmates. What? Yay! Yay! Whoa, 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 whoa. Give me five. I would love to have new classmates. Yeah, that way we don't have to play all by ourselves at recess. This is going to be so much fun. Oh boy, here they come. Now be prepared, students. Things are a little bit different because it's Halloween. So don't be scared if anything unusual happens. Oh, this is so exciting. I'm not scared. I'm not scared at all. I'm a big kid. Yeah, me too, me too. Double, double, toil and trouble. Scale of a dragon, tooth of a wolf. Mm, I forgot the rest of the words. Bibbity bobbity boo. Kick me out. I've turned into Katya Spelling from the Super Monsters. <laughs> Anywho, I brought some new classmates. Whoa, sleeping BB just turned into Katya Spelling and she brought the Gerbas. Plus, I see a whole bunch of new classmates. Let's have Sleeping BB Katya park the Gerbas. Here we go. The Gerbas comes with its own sound effects. Spooky, spooky for Halloween. I think that's a sign that the Gerbas is ready to drop off our new LOL classmates. Let's open the Gerbas up. And here are our new LOL students. They're Series 4 Wave 2 Little Sisters. And we've got three. Hello, Teacher It Baby. Whoa, hello, Sweeping Baby. You've transformed into a witch today. Yep, I'm Katya Spelling from the Super Monsters. I've dropped off the new classmates. Hmm, how come you're not in your Halloween costumes? Oh, we will be in just a little bit. We were just waiting for our new classmates. Anywho, toodles, happy Halloween. Whoa, that is so cool. Yeah, did you see her really cool witch's hat? And the gold bus. That is really spooky fun. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, am I excited for the new students and Halloween. We have to get our class ready. There's nothing out yet. I was so excited waiting for the students that I didn't get anything ready. So let's get on in. Oh no, oh no, oh no. I don't know where everything's at. Ooh, what did I do with it? Oh no. Oh no, the kids are going to be in the class and the new students are going to think I'm a teaching failure. I still want it to be really nice and Halloween-y and, and, and all perfect for them. Well, maybe we can help. Oh, I would really love that. Okay, I'm going to go work for the stuff. Okay, let's see. A classroom needs some desks. Let's get one desk in there. Here's desk number two. Number three, and number four. Now since there are going to be five students, we're gonna need one more desk, so a very special student gets to sit in the front. Let's make some room for this fifth desk. And now all of the students can have a very nice view of the board. Now up here is where we can put the sinks so all of the students can wash their hands and stay nice and clean to prevent those germs from spreading. We can have some toys up here like Ring Toss and Duck's Family. We can also put a fun toy car that the LOLs can ride in. So that'll be their play area. Here is where their cubbies are at. They can store their musical instruments. There's plenty of space for more. And they can also store some of their toys. Here are some picture books for reading time. We've got a book about beach balls. And 
we've also got a Storytime Classic, An Ugly Duckling. And the classroom is all ready. Yay! I'm going to sit at my desk and be on my best behavior. Me too. I can't wait for costume time. Oh, wonderful. You are in your seats. Okay, I think I'm ready for my new students. All right, student number one. Let's see which new LOL sister this is. It could be a little brother or a little sister. And our secret message is sweetheart. Let's keep going. We've got a blue ball and you guys know last time we opened the blue ball, we had a little brother on the inside. Here we go with our very first bag. And we've got a handbag in here. What about here? Here are some boots. Oh, and the chain to our ball. So one of the bags in each of the balls is gonna be the chain to our ball, and we're just gonna skip it just to get to the fun part. Here is our new classmate. Who's it gonna be? It's Little Scribbles from the art club. All right, who's gonna be our next classmate? The secret clue is Fashion Fan. Our very last layer. Here is the first accessory. We've got a cell phone and this time it's kind of different. Of course the charge is almost out on this cell phone too and it's cracked, but on the cover I think it might be a little SPF cutie. Here goes our next bag. It feels like a handbag. Yep, it's a really cool handbag. Let's see who our little sister was. Oh, it was her right on the screensaver of the cell phone. It's not little SPF cutie. It's actually little sweet princess from the glam club. And our very last student. The secret message is pet lover. This little secret message used to be puppy love, but they changed it and now it's pet lover. Here's the first accessory. We've got sunglasses. What about in here? Ooh, we've got a slimy bag. So who is our new classmate? We shall soon find out. Whoa, it's Little Batty from the Storybook Club. So they're not a part of the Opposites Club, but we've got Little Goody and Little Batty in the Storybook Club. Time to see each of our little new classmates' color changes. Dunk them all in the water, whoa! I love these color changes. Let's take a look at Little Sweet Princess. She is pink all over, which is totally fitting of her. She's got a pink bow, a little pink top, pink gloves, and pink boots. Let's see if there's anything on her diaper. Of course, a bow. How about little scribbles? She's got scribbles all over her diaper and a black top. Plus, yep, scribbles on the back and black boots and her hair turns all pink. Now, what about little Batty? She's got a really cool look to her. She's got blue eye makeup. She's got black suspenders, black and white diaper, black boots, and little black wristbands. Plus, her entire head is all black now. Wow, those are some really cool color changes. Yeah, we have new classmates and now it's costume time. Oh yes, you are very white. Right. Welcome, welcome all students to my class. Today is Halloween and we're having a very special Halloween celebration. So, Heartbreaker, let's start off with you. What do you want to be for Halloween? I want to be a vampire. We can definitely help out with that. Let's get her vampire cape on. Let's bring it around. And we've got our little vampire. Yay. I'm gonna walk around and say blah 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 to everyone. Blah blah blah. Oh, silly, silly heartbreaker. 
Okay, unicorn, what do you want to be for Halloween? Well, I want to be an alicorn. Half Pegasus, half unicorn. For little unicorn's Pegasus wings, I have just the thing. Here she is with her lovely Pegasus wings. And she's gonna need a unicorn horn. Ooh, she looks like a really pretty alicorn. She is ready for trick-or-treating. Hey, I've always wanted to be a alicorn. Cute costume. Thanks. I wanna be a witchy. Okay, little baddie wants to be a witch. Let's get a festive outfit on her. She's kind of starting to look like a pumpkin, but she's really got those Halloween colors going. We don't want to forget her witch hat. Yay. Okay, little sweet princess, what do you want to be? Well, since I'm already a princess, I want to be Rapunzel. That's perfect because we've got a Rapunzel dress right for her. Make sure her shoulder straps are on. And there she goes. She looks so adorable. Yay. Rapunzel, Rapunzel, wet down your heels. I can't. I have mine in a bow. And the last little student is little Scribbles. Well, I want to be a ghost. Ooh, very festive Halloween-y choice. And we've got just the thing. Let's get this through her head. Make sure it fits right. Oh, no. It might not fit her right but let's get her little hands through. There you go, she's peeking just a little bit through, and she is a happy little ghost. Boo! <laughs> Ooh, I'm a ghost. Ooh. Um, Miss It Baby, what are you gonna be for Halloween? Well, I'm gonna be a spooky, spooky bat. Excellent choice. We've got some bat wings for Miss It Baby. Here she goes with her bat wings. And the bat makes the sound ee, 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 all through the Halloween night. Now is the time for the special surprise. You kids are not going twig or treating during school, right? But you can go twonk or treating. <laughs> wow, twonk or treating? Whoa, what is that? I've never been twonk or treating before. Me, evil. Well, let me show you. Oh, go, boss. <laughs> You called? Come on, kiddos. Line up for your trunk or treating palooza. Oh, yeah. Let me get your candy baskets. Wow. i never gone trunk or treating before. What do we do? Well, instead of going to people's doors and trick or treating, your friends and family, like your school, put the candy in their trunk, and then you take the candy from the trunks to go trunk or treating. Of course, with a grown-up. Oh, that is really cool. Yeah, yeah, I can't wait to go twonk or tweeting. Me too. Okay, so here are your baskets. Who wants the pumpkins and who wants the ghosties? I want to go since I'm a ghost. Okay, here goes the ghost trick or tweeting basket. I'll take a ghost one too. All right, here's one more ghost one for you. And the rest of you can have pumpkins. Wow, yay, I love pumpkins. Very halloween -y. Me too! Chunk or tweet! Give me something sweet to eat! Well, it's the end of our show! I hope you guys enjoyed going trunk or treating with our new little LOL classmates. Let me know in the comment section if you've ever gone trunk or treating before. And also, let me know which one of the costumes was your most absolute favorite. Have a super fun, safe Halloween, and until next time, I hope to see you again soon! Bye for now!